how of it all. This is the second part of the video of how to make a multiplayer game on Visual Basic. So open your last project and let's continue with our work. Right, private. Skill connect as string equals local host equals sorry server equals now add my skill host and then a semicolon and add user id equals and my skill user let me start up the ramp and same column and add password equals and add my SQL pass and add a simple and at last the database okay so we'll write database equals and add my SQL db Okay, now double click on the form and we need another variable which is SQL connection as new MySQL connection. Okay, so now when form loads, so when form loads, we gonna paste this snippet, okay? The SQL function dot connection string equals SQL connect. Try if SQL function dot state equals connection state dot close. If the connection is closed then open it and show message box that it has been successfully connected and else open it and say it has been closed and if there is any error it will catch up in the message box now let's test to see if it works or not Oh, we have to create a database, okay? So what you have to do is right click on the web and click PHP My Admin. Or you can do it by opening your opening your favorite browser and writing HTTP slash local slash PHP My Admin. And you'll get that. So now let's add our database, which is simple, a simple game. Yes, create it. Okay, now let's just. 
see it has been successfully connected connected to my school device okay we can now continue without tutorial